Welcome to another episode of Fish Dive Cook. We're out here. It's super windy. It's cold. I got both the kids. We're gonna go forage for some mushrooms, check out the tide pools, see what's in there today. So uh, we're gonna get up in there and uh, enjoy this cold, freezing tide pool day. So, Clay, you wanna tell everybody a hi? Say hi, everybody. To look this way and say hi, everybody. Yeah, it's a little cold, so. Um, we have our scale, we have our bucket. I have another digital scale in my pocket, um, just in case. Bring two scales just in case. Uh, if one fails, I have a backup. And uh, 10 pounds of muscle each per day. You can only pull them with your hands. No tools, no nothing, no crowbars, no screwdrivers, no pliers, no tools, strictly hand. And um, we'll go through a little sustainable way of how to pull muscles that way we have muscles for generations to come so they can enjoy some muscles when they get older so uh let's go and let's go get some muscles okay we're gonna go get some muscles See if there's any more shells. Oh, that's another shell right there. Cool. Okay, these are called turban snails. See that? See the snails inside? Yeah. Okay, we gotta make sure we put it back though. Okay, where we found it. All right, come on up. So don't, so don't step on the green stuff. Okay, that seaweed is slippery. Okay, come on up. Okay, watch your step. Any muscles over here? Don't go too close to the water, okay? Because we don't want you to get wet. So there's no muscles over here either. There is a lot of opihis here. Here, why don't you let that snail go? There's a lot here that we can pick again. Put it, put the snail back in the water. Okay, put it back in the water over here. Let him go. Okay, there you go. Put it back. No, put it, put it back uh, so it, it can see, it can touch the bottom. Yeah, so the feet touches the bottom. Yeah, turn it around, turn it around. Okay, come on. Perfect. That way it can go free. Let's see if we see any more mussels. I don't see any mussels around here. Just a lot of snails. Turban snails. All right, there's a couple of mussels right here. So we'll take a look. It doesn't look like much. Very small. No. Really small muscle bed. A lot of uh, turban snails. Some opihi here and there. A lot of limu right here. Seaweed. That you could actually use to make poke and stuff. Alright, there's some uni over here and some mussels so looks like all the nice ones are over here nice bed right here so we just pull and twist 
Yeah, these nice ones. These are cool. Pull and twist. And just try and get them off. Just the beard only. So this right here, gooseneck barnacles. So this area that we're harvesting mussels are, uh, it is pretty rough today. So just keep in mind, I'll always keep an eye on the shore um, and just face the waves. Be aware, be alert, keep your ears open. If you hear a wave crashing, drop everything and just like head back up to the high ground. So just keep that in mind. Uh, we got, got maybe about four pounds worth of mussel right here. So I think this is good enough for us to eat. Yeah. Let's see. Our scale. Yeah, about five pounds. So this is perfect. It's all we need for today. Um, the kids are hanging out with Uncle Jarrett. There they are. All right, we're good. So we'll make a meal out of this right here. Step. 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 <laughs> Yeah, all right. Let's do some cooking, huh? There's a little more, Daddy. Let's do some cooking. Can it help me out? There's one more. Okay, we'll put this in here. Okay. First things first. Ash, with your hands. Like that. And the garlic all pops out. See, and then you take the skin off of it. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. Go so help me put, take all the skin off of it. Oh, What's the, that? Chopping the, the garlic up. All right, two tablespoons of butter right here. There is a ton of rockfish here. The rockfish here are humongous. That butter going. Is there enough garlic, Kalea? Yeah. What does it smell like? Uh huh. So we're gonna cook it. Yeah, we're gonna cook that. Get that butter nice and melted. A little bit, about four and a half pounds worth. Now we're wash them in some water. Yeah, thank you. Here, chop it up for me. Okay, the way to chop it, you gotta hold on to it. Look. Use your right hand, hold on to it, and then chop it. But you gotta watch out for your fingers, okay? Watch your fingers. Look, look, see, you're, you're gonna chop your, yeah, don't chop your fingers. Okay. Help me with the lemon. Use, don't use that knife though. Use the, uh, use the orange knife. How's that coming along? See that? Just squeeze. White wine. What is this? It's from 2013. Chardonnay. This is because we don't drink too much in the house. That's why we have that. Okay. Put that in the back. It's gonna taste good. Yeah. We're gonna boil it. Yep. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. And we'll start throwing some muscles in there. Come on, Clay. See you later. Bye, I'll see you next time, okay? Say, Uncle, see you later. Clay, tell Uncle, see you later. Oh, yes! Look at our muscles. Let's get it all in that beautiful sauce. Do you see that? Uh, can we open it? Yeah, well, it's already open, so once they open a little bit, I mean, they're gonna. You're all set. So now we're just getting it into the sauce on the bottom. See all that nice sauce? Oh, steamy. A bit more. Okay, here. You want to try one? Mmm, 
That is good. Mm. What does it taste like? Um, it tastes like yummy. <laughs> so, we passed the taste test. It tastes like yummy. So. Mmm. Oh, man. Good taste test. We're gonna have some muscles. Come on this side. Come on this side. Okay. All right. So we're gonna we're gonna try some of our muscles here. Mmm. Let me peel one for you. Oh man. Has that on it? I don't like it. <laughs> I'll eat it then. Here, I'll give you a different one. Oh, this one. Bite it. Mmm, that one's good. Man, these are good. The only thing I wish I had right now is some bread. This is off the hook. Eat some. You ate some earlier. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh, is that good? Mm. You don't need any salt in any of these because they already have the oceany flavor, so they already packed with salt in here. Um, man, it's this is yummy. Is that yummy? Yeah. Yeah, this is so good. This is so so good. Like it's a good day of hanging out with the kids and eating up this food. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. But yeah, we have a whole bunch full that we made. So we're gonna take some home and eat some of that too on the way home. We're, we're gonna save it for mommy. We're gonna save it for mommy. Mommy's gonna eat a whole bunch. Oh, it's so good. It's so fresh, like straight from the ocean. Kai's eating some chicken. Um, also, there are certain times when you can harvest these. There's actually the, there's a mussel hotline. I'll put it down into a link. Um, due to algae blooms during certain times of the months and in the years, um, you can't really eat mussels during those times. So, I'll put the link in the description below. But, I hope everybody had a good time following us around and uh, enjoying the tide pools with us. And... I want to wish everybody a happy new year since I didn't really post anything during that time. And man, this is, if we just had some hot bread, oh, garlic bread, it will be off the hook. But man, so hungry. Um, so anyways, thank you. Thank everybody who is a subscriber. Thank you. Even if you didn't, haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. And is that good? And thank you for coming along with us. And Daddy, yes, make sure you make sure you peel that off. Mm. Yeah. And thank you for watching another episode of Fish Dive Cook. Shaka. Can you shaka to the camera? Shaka or thumbs up. That that. Thumbs up and cheese. cheese. See you later. Cheese. See you later. Yummy. These are so yummy, Claire. I want some. I'll give you some more. We have a lot. Ooh, yummy. 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 Very, very. Delicious. Try the recipe at home. Yeah. 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 That means it's good.
We can get some more. All done. Peace. Let's go. Come on, let's wash hands. <laughs>